Hello, welcome back. We're going to jump straight into a reading with Armand Warren and his baby mama, Etsy. Okay, give it up for these two people, honey, on the show. Now, they've been here before. Okay, so I just did a reading on Armand and Regine. Okay, you go check that out and see what, what, what were the results. Okay, because... It seems like Mr. Armand is still missing somebody. And I want to know, is it Essie or is it somebody new? So, we're going to go ahead and pull some um, read cards on this relationship right now. We're going to see what's the current energy between these two. What's the, And we're going to see how he feels about Essie, how Essie feels about him, and what's the mutual energy. Okay, you know how we do. So, let's jump straight into it. Now, these cards right here are going to tell me, what is the energy between... What okay, let's say we're gonna do what could be the future. We're gonna do a future prediction real fast, real quick for Armand and Etsy. Okay. All right, so we got a little cluster to come out, and we're just gonna take the little cluster, baby. Okay, baby, somebody dreaming over here. Somebody dreaming for either this to happen, this to be, but as you see, this person is walking out of a door. Okay, so are you walking out of a situation? Somebody's looking for a new start. Oh, okay, I see. So the future of this relationship, one of these two are looking for a, few, a new start. It says, trust yourself. Push your fears aside and take a leap of faith when it comes to this relationship because time is of the essence when it comes to this connection. And it speaks about loyalty because we got this little dog here, honey, walking beside this person. So somebody's looking to the stars, looking to the future, and hoping that they can get a new start with they, with this person, okay? With the empress, the empress, that's the baby mama the deck, okay? Somebody that she's nurturing, she's the mother, she's um, she's everything to this person, okay? I'm assuming that this energy is coming from Armand because it's mainly Armand's reading with a little bit of Etsy, okay? Since I pulled this picture up and found them, I'm like, okay, why not? Because I still want to ask him a little bit about, you know, just him. But right now, we check it on these two. And it says, time for action. Give birth to your dreams. Uh-oh, we got somebody about to give birth, giving birth. Or, like again, giving birth to a dream here. Somebody hoping for a dream, hoping for a new beginning. Create Creative projects will be very successful. Abundance and prosperity. Oh, so is she, is she pregnant by him? I don't know, but this is... Speaking of pregnancy, uh, birth, dreams, it could be somebody, um, like again, it's the dreamer. The dreamer is hoping for a new start. So giving birth to a new start to this relationship. We got the two of ones moving forward. Again, we got a lot of moving forward, hoping and wishing, manifesting, waiting for the right timing to take the next step. Bold and very ambitious choices, partnering with others. Okay, so they may even be partnering together collabing some type of collaboration between these two but it is a partnership that's and again sharing your dreams okay this giving me at this point that this is something they both discuss okay and want it this is a discussion it's becoming it's, it's something that's in the works expanding your plans it says partner with others who share your dreams again moving forward okay it's a lot of moving forward energy with them Again, we got the star. It's like a wish fulfillment. Uh, becoming that couple again. They may even become that couple again on the internet. It says have faith. Again, have faith. The future is bright. Dreams come true. Positive change that will bring in into any challenging times. Okay, the challenging times being the breakup, I guess. It says the light at the end of the tunnel. Yes, this is something that somebody been wanting a long time. Okay, then we got the six of ones. Victory! Wow, okay. I ain't mad at this little energy. It's wise choices that bring public recognition and success. Promotion, awards, and scholarship. Yeah, I see them getting back together. I see them maybe even having a baby together, having more kids. I, I, this is something that they both seem like they've been dreaming about, wanting. They both standing with each other. They're waiting for the perfect time to make it official, okay, to make it come to come out with it. But this is something that's in the plan, that's in the works right now. All right, let's see what these cards have to say, if it confirms. Okay, let's make sure both are on the, on the same page and not just one side. 
So let's get the energy for our mind when it comes to Essie first. All right, now let's get the energy for Essie when it comes to this connection. Okay, and let's get the mutual energy in the beginning. I mean, the mutual energy between the both of them. It's like the mutual energy between the both of them was very complicated. It didn't want to come out right. It's not flowing properly. So even though they planned and trying to get it together, I don't know how it's going to turn out, girl. Because that energy was barely wanting to pop. It barely wanted to do what it was supposed to do. But let's see. Um, now, when it comes to Armand energy, when it comes to, to Essie, honey, he it's a, some finessing is going on here. Somebody being played like a clown. <laughs> Somebody being played, getting something in a slick way, smoothing things out. But it says buttering up, persuading somebody, and trying to charm. So whether he being played like a clown or not, I, I feel like he's willing to be a clown. Okay, to go back and you know, make the situation, trying to smooth it out, trying to charm his way back in, persuading something, buttering up to Etsy in some type of way that he probably even looked like a clown. I don't know. I don't know their relationship. But you know how boys are when they feel like they're going back and begging and so like they, they feel like a clown that their homeboy is finding about it. So that's what this card is giving me. Even though that's what he wants, though, because he's thirsty for it. Very thirsty for it. Needing validation. Fishing for compliments. Desperate. Horny. Too eager. It's like, you know, even if she's speaking about it, she, she's saying, you know, give it time, Amon. Give me, give me six months. Give me this. Give me that. Whatever. And he's just very eager. Just always, you know watching what you're doing with this i'm gonna come over and do that just too eager and also just pushing up on her okay okay again with that texting hoovering communication uh looking at what's going on on the internet looking at what's going on, on social media it's like casual interaction messaging they communicating back and forth with each other during text messages okay and it's saying thinking before responding. He may be responding out of emotions, okay? Which could also push her back some. That's why it's taking her longer than usual. Being too thirsty, too, being too greedy. Then we got this slut shaming. Expressing your sexuality, shaming, feeling judged, double standards, and also casual interaction. Which means, yeah, he very... When it comes to chemistry... Yes, he's very driven by her. He He's very much infatuated, let's say that. Okay, I do see casual interaction here with these two. You know, she probably gave him a little bit, honey. He then gave, jumped him out, honey. And it's like, come down, Iman, come down. Okay, so let's see how she's feeling towards him. Look at that energy. By Felicia, again, a lot of pushing back, pushing him back. He wanted so much, he's so horny, so thirsty for it. And she more pushing back because it's, it's unattracted to her. Okay? Let her want you. If he go out there, see, I bet she want him when he out there in a relationship. And he's showing out and making her jealous. And then she pull him back just to throw him the deuces again. Because he get back into this um, thirsty type of energy. And that makes him unattracted to her. Okay, and then so it's leaving and not caring. I mean, when I say like throwing up the deuces and not giving two Fs, she don't mind playing with his heart. She'll play ping pong with his heart. It says whatever over it. It's like she probably say whatever and hang up on him and block him. Playing with this man's heart. Okay. At the end of the day, he just won't, he won't, you know, he won't happiness with her. He want to be with her. Okay. But it says a good, look, a goodbye for now, which means she quick to call him back. If he get too happy, she train, she playing him like a man be playing some girls, okay? So she got his heart on a string, baby. A yo-yo string at that. Because we got the glow up, a major self-transformation, -trans doing the work to be better, make over, change appearance, okay? We got, it could be appearance, a change in her appearance. It could be a change in his appearance, the glow up, okay, with the glow up. A savage, ruthless, getting what you want, don't give a F. Okay, look at that energy she giving out. Okay, she give out that nasty energy because she feel like she can. 
Don't hold back tough skin, confidence, and bad ass. Okay. Flat lining. Really, this relationship is over, but she don't mind yo yoing with his heart. A relationship or situation is dying. The conversation went dead. Block. Again, I see her blocking. And then he'll beg and get right or go call from different phones and she'll let him back in. She lose interest real fast in him. Okay. And and he it seems like he go through a lot of glow up and change and trying to please her just for her to still be like, Oh my god, I'm over you, Oman. Forget you, Oman. Whatever. And throw up the deuces. Now what's the mutual energy energy between the two of these? Okay, we got Bay here. Before anyone else, okay? Again, I feel like a mom put her before anyone else. That's why his relationships don't work out. That's why he can't stay focused. Because she yo-yo with his heart. We got babe before anyone else. Someone special. A lover. Couples. Love life. They got a love life here. Very extra. Over the top. This could be her energy. Over the top. Trying too hard. Completely unnecessary. Excessive. Dramatic. Out of place. Okay. Stay, staycation. A vacation at home. They probably spend a lot of time at, at, at the house. Like, you know so-called as a family they do all this stuff behind closed doors then we got self enterprising adventurous destroying tradition diverse young people individuals individuality so the energy between the both of them okay they, like I said she'll come in and play into his, play into his emotions with this bay card okay because that's her baby daddy okay and that's his baby mama so they put each other before one another some kind of way okay They'll play that card, but it seems like it would be very extra over the top. Maybe he would even do some stuff that's over the top out here to get her attention, just for her to get her to unblock and call because she ain't doing it but sitting at home, okay? And then so, but I also see, you know, I don't see them as being couple goals. I see it started off with Bay just to play with the heart, and then she ended up saying bye, Felicia. Yo yo, his heart is all about them being individuals and I feel like they came from different cultures okay with that diverse card they come from different cultures therefore um it won't be it, it'll always be a flatlining situation even though she might she don't mind playing with them okay for her own and it's almost like she gets she get a kick off of it too with this savage card she get a kick of knowing that she can get them back and bring them back Okay, and she give him a little bit, okay, and he gets acting thirsty, acting crazy, whatever he be doing over there, texting, calling, hoovering, because he feel like he's not meant for Nessie, all in his emotions and his feelings. But again, the whole goal here, at least in his mind, is to have this relationship to be. And she probably play into those emotions, like I said, to get what she wants. But you see how her energy is over here. So that's going to be the energy for Etsy and Amon. Okay, catch me on the next one.